Hi guys, Odyssey Gaming here and welcome back to another Inform player review and today we will be doing Inform Mario Mandzukic. The Mandzukic, obviously the striker from Juventus, got 78 pace, 85 shooting, 65 passing, 80 dribbling, 40 defending and 87 physical which is pretty high physical. A 6 foot 2 with high high work rates, right footed and has a 3 star weak foot and 3 star skill moves. So Mandzukic is currently going for around 70 to 80k. I can see this dropping slightly just because there seems to be a huge crash in the market. Preparing for team of the year. And yeah, I am going to have to give Mario Mandzukic an 8.5 out of 10. I really did enjoy using this guy. He's very good in the air. Very good at flicking on the headers. In the box, he didn't seem to be, you know, too much of a threat for my opponent. Which is why he didn't really get higher. Because he is 6'2". I'd have liked him to score a few more headed goals. His shooting with his feet is incredible. His long shot's really good. He hit the post and the crossbar quite a few times for me. And in the box, he rarely missed an opportunity for me. Now, the only issue with him was, obviously, his heading in the box, he didn't seem to be there much. And in terms of shooting, a lot of his shots seemed to get blocked. Now, I don't know if that was his fault or that's something to do with the EA patch, but every shot that he had in his first two games for me was blocked. And then he did go on to score eight goals in his remaining four games, which was it's good for a striker. I did partner him up front with Inform Jonas, and they worked really well together. But yeah, Marin Mandzukic, he's really strong as well, 87 physical. I'm pretty sure he's got 89 um, strength or 89 aggression and 88 physical uh, aggression, vice versa sort of thing. But yeah, he did seem to be really strong on the ball. He didn't seem to give away any fouls. He seemed to easily shrug off defenders because 87 physical is more than most defenders on the game. And yeah, I did really enjoy using Mario Mandzukic. So that is why I am having to give him an 8.5 out of 10. Right, so for me, I'm going to have to give Mario Mandzukic a slightly lower score of 6 out of 10. So there are some positives to his game. He's very good at heading, coupled with his strength. So he's extremely good in the air, won most of the headers to nod on to his strike partner. And uh, basically didn't really get out strength too much on his runs on his way through to the goal. He's also got brilliant finesse shots, which is kind of weird. I thought he would be the player to have really good power shots, but his finesse shots were brilliant. Uh, that's how he scored me both his goals but they're really the only positives for me which I found of him his negatives is although he's very tall he hasn't got good movement in the box and he wasn't really there to win the headers in the box from the corners or crosses which is kind of unfortunate he doesn't really make too many runs although he's a target man type person I still like my target men to be in good space and make a few runs here and there and um, he hasn't got great long shots from outside the box and again, as I said, his, his power shots just seem to go straight at the keeper for some reason, not either side, straight at the keeper. So he only really scored the finesse shots, which kind of sucked. But I'm going to have to give Mario Mandzukic a 6 out of 10. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave it a like and subscribe for more content. If you've used Mario Mandzukic, tell us what you thought of him in the comments below. But apart from that, that's it. Thank you for watching and have a brilliant day.